we are now living in a world full of smart devices such as smartphones and smartwatches. Now, in the future, next step, we want to take it to another level to escalate the scale. We want to boost, build smart facilities like houses that can do everything for you or by your commands. The way to achieve that is to deploy hundreds or even thousands of sensors so that you can have real-time sensing or response to all human actions. However, there's one key limiting factor to keep us from achieving our dreams, batteries. The batteries have limited life, lifetime. That means you need, to you, you need to recharge or replace them after they die. That is fine for personal devices. However, it is impossible to take care of thousands of them in small facilities. That's why I'm here to introduce energy harvesting. We want to re uh, replace or even eliminate all batteries in future lives. Energy harvesting collects unused power around us, for example, solar, heat, vibration, and radio wave. Take radio wave, for example. As you can see here, we build a very simple circuit to collect the radio power and convert it into the electricity to turn on an LED. The good thing of that is because the radio is broadcasting 24-7, and that means the LED can be turned on 24-7 without recharging or replacing of that, like batteries. That means with the energy harvesting, for the future, we can eliminate all the batteries and power up the thousands of sensors without the small facilities. And we don't need to maintain that at all. Like, we don't need to recharge, we don't need to replace, we don't need to maintain all of that. That is a tremendous drop in the cost. And because of that, we can now build small facilities like small homes, small cities, or even small planet. And Imagine how convenient it would be. In the future, the only thing you need to do is sit there giving out commands and wait everything to do it, have to be done automatically for you. And all that fabulous future visions will all converge to one single starting point, turning on an LED using energy harvesting. That's all my presentation. Thank you.